Cool. Congrats on the movie, guys. Thank you. Thank you. It's great fun. Uh, Sandra, I wanted to start with you. You've played some amazing characters in your career. You've won an Oscar. Now you get to tick off the walking disco ball part of your yes. CV. Yes. Has that always been a Always, career? always. That was sort of, if, if before I die, may I once <laughs> please just, and then you can fill in the blank, with sequence. <laughs> it was always with mid-sequence. <laughs> <laughs> and the Queen of Throb as well. That's another one, isn't it? Uh, you know, it's, it's um, there's no shame in it. I wanted to take this, the shame out of the throb yeah. Yeah. from a woman's point of view, yeah. because sometimes we are a part of it. Um, and I wanted to be proud of what my part may or may not have been. Yeah. Uh, I, I, Daniel, I saw an interview with you this morning on the way in, and you were talking about in the script about the meat and cheese vortex, <laughs> yeah. which I thought was just the most insane bit of writing you must have read ever. It, it was up there, yeah. I mean, it was also, um, there's always something really exciting when a special effects guy looks like they're about to do something insane. And they had, <laughs> uh, for that moment, they brought in two massive fans. And one of them said to me, we're never normally allowed to use these inside. Because they're clearly just for like blowing smoke across wide swaths, swathes of jungle. And he like, they brought them in and just, uh, yeah, absolutely destroyed the place. It was great. It was funny doing an international press yesterday, the French journalists. Oh, we're it came up <laughs> multiple appalled, times appalled about like, what, did you, what happened so to it? Cheese. Yeah. <laughs> We're like it died it on died. my face, but it yeah. died. Yeah. 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 The, was it a, was it a smell? Was it smelly in there? Was it all uh, fake no, cheese? It wasn't, it wasn't no. because the room was massive. Yeah. The oh, room okay, because of those fans and what we had to pull off. And the maybe, room was huge. Maybe they sprayed it as well, so it they, might they, not have... Well, we had an uh, issue with flies. Oh yes. We were. Yes, you, we remember there were these yes. tennis racket things yes. that have you know you swat at the fly and it yeah. zaps them. I've so that. all I watched were people zapping the flies and they were dropping into the cheese, <laughs> knowing that that cheese would then be in my face. It just wasn't. Yeah, I hadn't yeah. thought. That. Remember? Yeah, I'm sorry about yeah. that. that I, I do remember. You're not really, but that was fun. Brings him such joy when he talks about what hit my face. It's not sorry. You know what? I bought one of them last summer because I had. Right. They're yeah, brilliant. but I didn't realize it was like semi electrified. So when I was yeah, doing it, I was like, wow, wow. Right. Yeah. From the yeah. pound yeah. shop, yeah. that was yeah. as well. Yeah. Keep Mad. them away from children. Mad guns are good as well. Yeah. <laughs> sorry. Anyway. <laughs> um, Sandra, I wanted to ask you as well about you work with Hugh Grant and some of the bloopers that you guys have, particularly what he says on the bloopers. How does Daniel compare with the British? Well, swearing. D Daniel is much more composed than Hugh was. Uh, Hugh's, Hugh's joy was in wrecking me. Daniel obviously had more respect for me, and he wanted me to succeed. Daniel yeah. did. Um, both I appreciate. I you need the balance. Yeah. Oh my gosh. It just, all I have to say is ice cubes. It would okay. just, there was, it was just a series of train wrecks that somehow we cobbled together a film um, on that one. Yeah. Also, I feel that they're just words that only Hugh can say in the Hugh. Some of the words he oh, says is like, just, it's like, it's like, it's totally what Hugh yeah. Grant would say if he, if yes, he blooped. Yes, yes. Oh, we'll oh dear, dear, dear. Um, and I wanted to ask you about um, Brad's cameo. Is it cameo? He's so good at comedy and he very rarely has get to do comedy. Right, Are you surprised right. that he hasn't been able to do more comedy? Because he's so, he has such a great comedic timing. I think timing. that's probably his choice. I Brad so, Pitt yeah. can do whatever Brad Pitt whatever wants, wants yeah. to do, <laughs> is my guess. Wouldn't yeah. you think? I would imagine so. I think if Brad yeah. said, I want to do a comedy, People somebody would, would like, go, yes, okay. Please do a comedy. Here's a hundred yeah. million dollars, do what you want. <laughs> he does have that Tom Cruise power, doesn't he? Where it's just like, so what I, do you want to do think, today? I think he does. I do think he does, you know. So whatever. you, all right? I have that Tom Cruise power? Yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. I didn't know until now. I have Sandra Bullock power. Yeah. I don't know what that gets you, but I'm excited to have it. <laughs> uh, just finally, uh, as an Oscar winner yourself, Sandra, do you think the world is at a point now where we're ready to see Daniel Radcliffe win an Oscar oh, playing Weird Al, Weird Al Yankovic? <laughs> because I feel do you know like how incredible? I feel like it might be coming. Well, I think that we're evolved enough now to handle it. Yeah. Um, I think Daniel playing Weird Al is. It, it, it is inspired. It is, you go, wait, what? And then you go, oh my God, this is exactly going to be amazing. Reaction. I'll show you, I haven't shown you a photo yet, have I? I'll show you no, a I saw, oh, I, you saw, I saw yeah, a little yeah. pap okay. shot cool. with that wig. Oh, yeah, okay, but no, I've got a proper one. I'll, go, I'll show you oh, a good photo. Oh, he's got a proper one. Yeah. <laughs> he's going to show me Without being rude, in the vortex of you playing Wolverine or playing Weird Al Yankovic, I feel yeah. like this is, that's oh, the Weird Al casting. Weird Al makes more sense to me. It's inspired. It's inspired, and I think when it hits, it's going to be all anyone's talking about. It's exciting. Yeah. exciting. Also, it's a lot you, of fun. Yeah, we get you to do that, and then Nick Cage is playing Dracula. I feel like the world. Oh is yeah, it's just we're all. I didn't know that. I didn't know that. So that's that. fantastic. I love Nick Amazing Cage's choices, man. Yeah. <laughs> so lovely to talk to you guys. Thanks awesome. so much nice for your time. You. Thank, Thank you very much. Thank you so much. That Dracula. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching. Hey, you guys. 
Hey, you guys, huh? Hey, you guys. Is yeah. that from the Goonies? It is indeed. Yeah. Nice. Hey! hey.